So, based on your own experience, give us a brief outlook for re-refined industry in, for the coming years. You mean here in Brazil or...? Um, around the world. Well, I would say um, the re-refiners that are today running um, are pretty well established. So I think anybody running today will be a player in the next five, ten years. We went through a cycle of people realizing we have to get more efficient, and we did. Um, as I said in my presentation, unless margins improve significantly, I do not expect new players. I don't think anybody will uh, invest in a new refinery with the current market with crude oil at $45 a barrel. Um, I think the, the trend of demand for re-refined base oil will go up. It's going up every year and we get more and more people asking because they want to be part of this kind of new era in which people use uh, refined lubricants. So as I said again on my presentation, I think we are at the bottom of the market price-wise. It's going to recover, it will take some time. But everybody running is efficient, and I think it's a great future, but it's just a matter of time. Okay. And, and what is the importance of this event for your company? It's good. It's particularly good. I mean, Bra the Brazilian uh, market for Finnish lubricants and base oil is the biggest in South America. We export base oil uh, to six different South American countries. This is a great place for me to come and see people that I am doing business with and hopefully meet some people that will try to do business in the future. So I will also recommend um, other blenders that are in South America but not in Brazil. That will be also an event for them to come. I see, I would say 90% here is more uh, Brazilian market. It would be better even to get more people from other countries in South America. but. For me, it's a great place to see a lot of people at the same time. Okay, thank you.